Hey Sagittarius, welcome to the channel. Welcome back if you all have been here before. Thank you all so very much for joining me. This is going to be for anyone with Sagittarius placements in their charts. Take what resonates, leave the rest with someone else. This is Twin Flame Tuesday. It could be past, present, future energy. It could also be someone else in your energy field. Only take what resonates, y'all. Y'all already know how this goes if you've been here before. Thank y'all for coming to the channel. Let's get into this. What is going on with Sagittarius and their Twin Flame? But those of you in a soulmate connection. You feel like you found the one, your twin, the only other person that completes you, a mature man, a text message, ready for love. Oh, can we stop? Addictions. I knew something was going to go wrong. Door is open and mystery lover. It says, a sexy secret admirer, crushing, always wanted you, shy and ready to come forward. So somebody, a mature man, is ready to love you. I am ready for love. India Ari, Ready for Love is your channel song of the day. Why are you hiding from me? Why are you hiding from them? Some of you as a Taurus, a Virgo, or a Capricorn, it says Earth signs, young, grounded, practical, self made, ambitious, and owns everything. Somebody is a landscaper. I don't know why I heard that. Somebody is a landscaper. Somebody works outside. They do some kind of outside work, your person. They could have dreads. Maybe they got highlights in their dress just like him. Could be a dark-skinned black man or just someone who's got a lot of good, beautiful melanin in their skin. They could be young but act very old for their age. They're very an old soul. They're very emotionally mature. This person, they a boss. They got their own business. Somebody could own like a t-shirt business. Somebody could own a shop like a... I don't know. I'm seeing somebody involved in tech. I'm seeing somebody involved in like clothing somebody in landscaping i just see somebody who they network a lot someone who networks a lot somebody is about to reach out to you we have you all on my mind i miss you and can't get enough of you some of you could have recently started dating this person maybe they recently told you that they feel this way about you or they're thinking about doing so they are ready for love this person is tall and handsome it says no games wants commitment emotionally available and knows how to treat a woman i know that's right we're going to clarify this addiction. I'm not going to clarify anything else here because it's, it's very, you know, self-explanatory. But what's this addiction? When I'm stressed about you, I drink or smoke. So maybe they drink or smoke. Maybe they've been doing that because they've been like, hey, they got a lot of tattoos. Maybe, um, wait a minute, I'm sorry, y'all. Somebody was born in 1981, 1991. Here. Okay. Um, it says door is open. Go for it. Take a leap of faith and they're ready. Spirit is saying this is the one. So why? who has addictions? Why is addictions here? That threw me for a loop. Everything else is so positive and nobody else got all of these um, positive cards, Sagittarius. You're the first. Oh, okay. This person likes to make money. That's their addiction. This person is young. We got the page of pentacles coming out. They could have recently started their own business or career. They recently have come into some type of financial abundance. And I feel like they might be really, really, especially if it's an earth sign, fixated on that. They feel like it's a part of their higher calling, right? A lot of you, this person just lets you know that they feel this felt this way about you. They've been holding on to it for a while. Could be a Libra, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Look at this, lovers. Could be a Gemini. This person sees you as their soulmate, y'all. A lot of them, <laughs> the, the addiction has been that they see you as a soulmate, but they're so money focused. You know, the page of pentacles can be someone who neglects you because they're chasing their dreams. They're very ambitious. This person is very ambitious. I told you they're younger, but they have an old soul. A lot of them could have grown up in an environment where they had to be more responsible than they needed to be. At an early age, you know what I mean? Like, I'm the man of the house and I'm seven. And it's like, no, baby, you're seven. You're not the man of the house. Or I'm the woman of the house and I'm seven. You know, it happens to girls and boys, especially, unfortunately, in the black community. Trying to pick up the slack sometimes in broken homes or whatever. Or maybe being the older sibling or something here. But this person takes on a lot of responsibility. And I feel like they may have struggled with making a decision. The lovers can represent a choice and a choice where you can only have one thing or the other. You can't have both. They made a judgment call, a final decision. I feel like the way that these cards are flowing, they were focused on their money, but they made a final decision to focus on love at the end. But the addiction has been money. Could have caused you two to separate in the past. Yeah, this person, somebody could work with cars or something like that. This person has been like holding back their feelings for you for a long time. Could be Leo, Scorpio, Aquarius, Taurus. Aries. 
some kind of tower moment has happened or will happen as a result of this money focus. Yeah. Guarded energy of walking away. But they're coming back. If you you two separate at, <laughs> at any point, it ain't over. It's never over with this person. This is your forever person. Y'all just wanted to work out some kinks because I do see money could come between you two. Ambitions could come between you two. But let's see. At least they're not addicted to drugs or something. They could, I mean, somebody could be. Don't don't quote me on that because it says when I'm stressed, I drink or smoke. And I mean, maybe that doesn't bother you. Maybe they smoke weed. Maybe they smoke cigarettes and that doesn't bother you. Or, you know, they could be addicted to it though. I don't know. Who is this person? It's an air sign, Libra, Aquarius, or Gemini. And it says liar. Be careful if someone's sneaky. Could definitely be an Aquarius here. That's an Aquarius card. Let's clarify that. Look at this. They want commitment. Things are getting serious. So someone else. Someone is in the middle. Someone is trying to sabotage this. And I was going to say with the liar, when it's Aquarius, if this is an Aquarius, that's someone who sabotages the connection. Could be wearing a mask. Um, what do I want to use to clarify? Let's use these. What's this liar about? Why is a liar showing up here? Look at this. Hiding their feelings. Cancer energy. Somebody's hiding their feelings for you with the tennis swords in reverse, but they're ready to reveal. This is why they're coming through. Look at this mask. This person has been wearing a mask for a long time, but they're ready to reveal themselves to you. Look at this. Ace of swords. Communication. Letting you know that they want you. They're clear that they want you and they're letting you know communication is picking up with this person. So they were lying about how they felt about you. Everything that's looking toxic with this person is turning out not to be when I clarify. But what's someone else? Who's just someone else? So they want this commitment with you. But we have the Ace of Cups in reverse. They recently broke up with someone. Or maybe you did. Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio that one of you walked away from. Some of you are dealing with a Scorpio for sure. You're on a Scorpio, Sagittarius, Cups. Six of Wands, somebody who had a lot of options. Six of Wands can represent a lot of people admiring you. Um, it's about admiration. It's about victory. It's about success. Could be a Leo. What is going on with this someone else? Hangman in reverse. This is somebody that could be a Pisces that they held on for two, two for two, way too long. I can't talk. <laughs> they had a third party or you had a third party. It ended with this person, but somebody's still holding on to the connection, although someone else has moved on to other options. Two of Pentacles. Yeah, someone made a choice here. Ace of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. With the King of Wands. Someone followed their, their passion, the person that they were passionate about. So either you or they have a third party that's no longer important, but that person still wants to be important. Oh, self-important. It's like, get, get out of here. You ain't important. Don't I care about you. Why are you still lingering around, holding on, holding out hope that it's going to come back together? It ain't hope. It ain't coming back together. Don't hold out hope. It ain't happening, Captain. It ain't happening, Captain. All right, y'all. Let's get some messages from them. We're going to get the likely outcome, what's happening next. But let's get some messages first, some Oracle messages from them to you, from you to them, from spirit to both of you, whatever you need to hear right now. Sagittarius, unconditional love, queen of cups, cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, caring, supportive, nurturing. Um, Yeah, this person is probably going to overdo it. They're going to be way, way, way emotionally available. This person is really, really loving you unconditionally. They have a lot of strong feelings for you. There is no future without you. You are part of my destiny. Some of you could be dealing with a Leo, Scorpio, Aquarius, or a Taurus, a fixed sign here. Somebody is like fully committed to loving on you. Fully committed to it. Waiting my turn. See, somebody has to close out another cycle here. Um... Maybe even with the addiction card, that could be somebody else. The third party, patiently waiting, calm, serene, tranquil, careful, and considerate. Sagittarius, that's your energy. Are you waiting for somebody to close out a cycle with somebody else? Or this is your person with their third party that won't let them go. My spirit is like, mm -mm. water seeks its own level. I chose them because they didn't challenge me like you do. Some of you, this whoever is the mystery lover here has been watching the other person in a connection that was not good. And they were just waiting like, mm -hmm. you over there, but I'm patiently waiting for that to end because I know it ain't going to last. <laughs> no one will ever come as close as you have to winning me over. This is no easy feat. So somebody's very guarded here. We're dealing with an air sign. Somebody's very guarded. Oh, you can have air placements in your chart if that's you. Um, and it's like it's hard to get through. 
but somebody about to break through and it's somebody who's been watching you or you've been watching for a long time and it's like the veil has been lifted the mask has been removed the feelings are on display you got the queen of cups completely open and vulnerable okay sagittarius what is the next move and the likely outcome for you and your person here i don't know but let's see let's see i'm gonna use the tarot what's this person's next move towards sagittarius look at this y'all they ready for you to come on over into their world. They like you've been through that mess up relationship or maybe they have, but they're ready to move on to this is the end of challenging times. Things are looking up a welcome relief, finding your way to a peaceful place in the end of depression or an illness, travel or relocation. Some of you could be at a distance, could even be abroad. Um, you may have to travel to you. You have to travel to them. But whatever the case, they come in, baby. They come in for you. One, two, twin, twin, coming for you. Three of swords. They're coming because they want to heal this heartbreak that you've been through with someone else. Libra Aquarius energy here. They're like, you've been through it. Let me let me make you feel better. It's time for you to walk away. Five of wands. It's time for you to walk away from this conflict with this Leo, possibly. Conflicts with others caused by opposing opinions. Walk away from drama unless the situation is really worth your time. Then stand up for yourself very ambitious so you could be attracting another fire sign a leo in particular what's the outcome here i'm just gonna get one card what's the outcome for sagittarius look at this king of cups you had the queen of cups now you get the king of cups this is your true counterpart here cancer pisces or scorpio possibly or someone with a lot of love for you emotionally mature trustworthy honorable devoted cautious someone you can completely trust a situation that is safe a solid romantic relationship hidden but well-intentioned emotions a charitable benefactor and seeing a counselor see they did have hidden but well-intentioned motives right there as that mystery lover they've been watching you i've been watching you what's your title gonna be i've been watching you and i'm on my way I'm on my way. Is it a song that says, is it like Chris Brown? Somebody sings a song about I'm on my way. Y'all know what I'm talking about if y'all know music. I should, I, I love music. And so you would think I would remember. I feel like it's Chris Brown. It's something about being on my way. Look that song up. I, I don't know if it's called On My Way. But it says something about being on my way. And they are, but that's six and fours. They sailing, they swimming, they flying, they driving. Whatever they need to do to get you. I don't care how you get here. Just get here if you can. They said there are hills and mountains between y'all, but they still gonna get over them because they coming towards you, Sagittarius. <laughs> Those are your messages. Like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, leave me a comment if this resonated or you claim it. Somebody wants you, they want you bad. All right, I'll see y'all Thursday. Peace.